Hello everybody, I'm John. Interesting Chinese character. Today we are going to learn three new characters. Let's start. Let's look at these three characters first. Yes, they are characters, they all have something to do with the, the, sun. No, the sun. First we do a little bit review. Okay, so first character, Kao which we learn with your mouth, right? Just like your mouth, call or a hole. The second character we learn is Yu, means the sun, the sun in the sky. So have a horizontal line in the call to make difference. Uh, they are all round, but Yu uh, has a line, okay? Then we're going to learn today's first character. I show you. That's Bai. You see, that's the sun with a Line. So look at here, please. The line kind of the a light of the sun. So you know the light of the sun, they're very bright, very shining. So this character means the color white. Bai. Some words with bai. First one, bai tian. Daytime. Bai is white, Tian is the sky day, or by word, white day, daytime, it means. Second one, Bai Jiu. You may know Jiu means alcohol in Chinese. Bai Jiu means white spirit. Actually, the color of this alcohol is not white, it's uh, no color, but we still call it Bai Jiu. By the way, this one is not Bai Jiu, it's just the uh, Shui. Bai se. se means color, so bai se, white color. Let's move on to next character. This character is yue, which means month or moon. Have a look at the old characters 3,000 years ago. Doesn't it look like a moon? I think so. It does like a moon. So the character basically means moon. Then it's got meaning month. Let's look at some words with yue. First one, yi yue. You may know the easiest character, number one, just the one line, right? Yi yue means uh, January. So how do you say February? Of course, two line and the yue, er yue. In March, san yue, three line. And the yue, like this, easy. Second one, yi ge yue. You know, ge is a magic word in Chinese. If we say yi ge yue, not means January. It means one month, one month. That's also a common question some students always ask me. So you say yi yue means January. How do you say one month? So we put a magic word to make it different. Uh, one month. Next one, yue uh, bing means uh, moon cake. Bing is kind of cake, uh, so yue bing. You see the picture? I love it. Wo xi huan chi yue bing. I, I love to eat moon cake. Wo xi huan chi yue bing. That's true. The last character, ming. See the older character. So, one sun and one moon be together. They are two, you know, brightest uh, thing in the sky. So they together, so very bright. Ming means bright. Also, you know, like the sun goes up, goes down, and the moon goes up, goes down. Just kind of one day pass, right? So Ming also got the meaning tomorrow or next. Let's say some words with Ming. First one, Ming Tian. Tian is sky, so Ming Tian, tomorrow. Ming Nian. You may know Nian means year. So Ming Nian, next year. And next, next example, Ming Zhu. Zhu in Chinese means pearl. So Ming Zhu is a bright pearl. Look at this picture, please. 
if you have been to Shanghai, you may know that's the TV tower in Shanghai. It's called the Dongfang Ming Zhu in Chinese. It's very famous. Dongfang Ming Zhu. Okay. Then let's look at the writing order. So if you got a pen, please try to copy these characters on your paper, stroke by stroke. The first one, by bright. By the way, you can read aloud. By. Second one, yue, yue, to help you to remember the tongue. I also mark the tongue here. So yue. Yeah. Next one, Ming. First, you write the sun, then the moon. Ming, bright. Okay, thank you everybody. I hope you enjoyed the class today. If you want to find your own tutor, please in visit our website, thechineseclassroom.com. I will arrange a very good character, no character, tutor for you. Okay, thank you. Bye-bye.